So I have two rectangles, namely rectangle 1 and rectangle 2. So I want to change its border radius into something like uh, 10 pixels and 50% pixels. So to do that, I'm going to go rectangle 1 and border radius 10 pixel. And the next one, rectangle 2, border radius, I'm going to make it a circle 50%. So if I just run this, you can see this. It is working right now. So as this code does not work with all of these, uh, all of the web browsers currently available, we would have to use something known as WebKit for older, uh, WebKit prefix for older uh, web browsers that, that work with WebKit. And this is how it works. And you have to copy that also to this one. And again, uh, you have Mozilla for the main, for the Firefox versions and border radius is going to be 50 percent so you also have to copy that to this side and then just type 10 pixels and you have many other things like uh, dash ms uh, border radius of microsoft web browsers and uh, that is going to be 10 pixels right here and you have to copy that again into this side and type 50 percent so there are some special and fast ways in order to do this in SAS that are known as mixing. So what a mixing does is just it has a simple structure or function that re that releases another string uh, according to the content of that function and according to a parameter that is given into that function. So I'm going to create a mixing right here in the top known as uh, let's let, let's call it border uh, border radius. You can call it whatever you like and then the radius okay now i'm going to return so I'm, i don't have to type return or anything but it, it just returns it so i'm going to use all of these things copy that out and then just type it right here and then i'm going to replace this with radius and and that's it so if you want to use or change it again you in this way you will have to change it again into 24 24 24 24 but with mixins you can do this easily by typing include border radius and it as a function like a function you can just do this right here and include border radius function is uh, the, what I said 10 pixels yes 10 pixels and if I want to change it I can use 10 15 pixels right here and it does the same thing as you can see it is compiled right here so if I run this and inspect it right here I have the inspection element tool and uh, let's go to that deal and as you can see I have all those uh, specific properties that I addressed in this in this function so you can use it in uh, any other function like if you want to create a mixing for uh, like transitions and transition uh, transition so here is the variable and first you have transition transition and then webkit transition transition so many of the functions of uh, many of the many of the properties support this uh, as many browsers have their own way of saying this so you can you can find out in the description down below I have something known as uh, a link to see what these are what what these prefixes mean